What are we doing here? Watch and see. Ah! Who are you? I know you are surprised and scared. I'm not Jenny. I'm the keeper of the sacred Asian tree of Okaku. You are welcome to your responsibility. It has been years I've been on this mission to bring you to take up your spiritual inheritance. Please, I'm begging you. Don't kill me. I'm the only child of my mother. Fear not. You are above human destruction. Sacred tree of a vacuum. Why? Why did you lie to me? Why did you take my mother from me? Why didn't you tell me the ultimate sacrifice was my mother? You deceived me. You deceived me. Why? Nobody no, deceived you. What you are seeing right now is what you bargained for. See, my dear, you possess the magic of the first order. And it is written in the sacred book that was made available to you. That promotion will take something you love and cherish so much. Why my mother? Why didn't you take someone else? Why? Now she's gone. What am I living for? You lack the ability to ask the secret order. Why? Now that you are promoted, go into the world and multiply. Friends in school. Cool. Yes, mommy, I'm very sorry. It's, it's the school driver that asked me to keep her company here before her parents arrive. So I promise it won't happen again. I'm very mm. sorry. Did you listen to yourself? Oh, her driver asked you to keep her here and take her off as a man or as what? Okay, your school driver and your mother, who are you supposed to obey? It's you. So why? See, I've told you I don't want to see you with anybody. And mm -hmm. I, I don't want to listen to you. I'm trying to
have one. We have avoid him immediately. What have I done? You've not done anything wrong to me. It's just my mother, she always beats me up whenever she finds me with you or any other student. So I just decided to stay alone. This is serious, but Mama is on her land. I swear, she's just making my life so uncomfortable and miserable. She refuses to believe that we need other people to survive. She just wants me to stay on my own. Why did she tell you her reasons for refusing you to associate with your peer group? No, she's not telling me anything. This one is just so frustrating, I swear. By now, you might, you might be thinking that I'm against you. But that is far from the truth. I mean, it's not even possible for me to hate you. Whatever I am doing is because of the love I have for you. I don't want you to get into troubles. I don't want you to make mistakes. Okay? That is why I want you to stay on your own. Forget everything about friendship. Because there are so many bad people. The world is so evil. The so-called friends might even put you into troubles that you find it very difficult to come out of. That is why I want you to stay on your own. Okay? And I noticed you didn't touch your food. Right? Can you please can I ask you a question? Sure, go ahead. Please, what is socialization and what are the agents of socialization? Mm. Let me please answer the question. You promise to answer me. In this world, we need other people to survive. We need our peer group, friends, and even extended family members. That's why we also need the church for moral and spiritual upbringing. Even God knows that we need other people to survive because man cannot live in isolation. So any child that is deprived of socialization, such a child will eventually become sick and even start developing psychological problems. Just like how I'm gradually turning into a cycle. Go for it. Why would you mention such a word? I reject it. It's not a portion. See, dear. <laughs> the thing is, you don't understand what I'm doing. But I know that very soon you will understand that I'm doing everything for your own good. Okay? That's the point. You see, your view on socialization is different from that of my social studies teacher hmm. and with all due respect your perspective is wrong what do you need to i can see this whole discussion is gradually turning to insult right you now lecture me on what is wrong and what is right do you even know your right from your left? Have you seen anything with your life? No experience, nothing. So you cannot lecture me. See, I, I think what you need now is to go and eat so that your brain will come down and think you are not the standard and counter words you do. It is small of us to be going to lecture me. I will go back.
Jasmine! Jasmine! Yes, mommy. Someone is knocking at the gate. Go and check who is there. Okay. Before that our friendship ends in school, so please, whatever it is that you have to tell me, please wait until we get to school. Okay, sorry. But well, you have to hear me out before you crucify me. Okay, what is it? I brought back your notebook. Remember we're having tests tomorrow, so I know you need it to prepare for the text tomorrow. Oh, thank you so much. But I can't accept this from you now, please. My mom is going to see it and question where it came from. I can't explain. But why now? You already know the reason why. Please start going before my mom sees you. Please, okay, please don't put me in trouble. Okay? Bye bye. Okay, tomorrow. okay now. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. Come back. Who was that? And why did it take so long to come back? It was the refuse man. The refuse man? Yes. So why did it take you so long to come back? When negotiating prices, his price was too high. His price was too high, so I just didn't do it. That means he didn't carry the thing. No, I told him to leave it. Break and left you all alone. Please, 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 please help me. Okay. Let me take you to the principal's office. Then you can reach out to your parents later. Shall we? What did they say happened to you? Your principal called me. Teacher Enki, thank you so much. If not for you, tell me what would I have done. Eh? You're welcome, ma. You know, it's the responsibility of every teacher to take care of every child in this manner. But your face looks familiar. Mm. Are you not Kansolo Machi? Mm. I guess I am. What a small word. She's your daughter. She's my everything. Oh. Wait, you just called me by my name. Yes. Have we met before? Oh, maybe you are one of my clients. Yes, I'm one of your clients, but it's been long I visited your office. It's been four years now. Oh, I think I recognize this place. Thank you so much. This is my house. Let's go in. of social integration and the and the activity of mixing socially with other people and the process of learning to behave in a way that is accepted in the society. And how is that related to my question? Um, Jasmine, my friend, our mom is against her interacting with other students. Over time, I, I tried visiting her, but it seems she, she does not want our friendship. 
So I don't I don't know what I would do. I just decided to stay on my own. This is serious. How can a counselor not know the meaning of socialization and social integration? Just go back to your class. Go back to your class. to discuss something very important with you. I was informed that your mother does not allow you to meet with anybody, your only friends. So if I told you that is absolutely correct. She forbids me from making any friends at all. So I just decided to play by our rules. I'll see what I can do about it. I'll go and meet her and talk to her about this and Please, I want you to understand that your mother loves you so much and whatever reason that is making her do this, I believe is for the best. You just have to believe me. Hmm? Just don't use her pearl, just keep me alive. You don't know it. Has it got into this? It's very serious, so like, in fact, I'm just, I'm just confused, I don't know what to do. That's why I just decided to play by a rule because... I'll still see what I can do about it. You are going home, right? Yes, I am. Let's just go together. Thank God you are here. Where is my daughter? That's why I'm here. What do you mean that's why you're here? Look at the time. It's past closing time and Jasmine is not here. I've been calling and calling. Nobody is speaking. Your daughter Jasmine is fine and she's doing just well. If she's doing well, why is she not here with you? That's the reason why I'm here. Your daughter doesn't want to see you, not have anything to do with you. What? She talk about you with so much hatred. Jesus! And I'm here to find out what you have done to her to warrant her to talk about you with so much hatred. Of a woman that loves her so much, I want the best for her. See, whatever questions you have, I will answer you, but that will be later. For now, I want to see my daughter. Where is she? You don't get it. Your daughter promised to end her life if I take you anywhere close to her. God forbid. The only thing you would do for me is to give me reasons that justify your actions. That's all. Why would my daughter think of taking her life? I don't know. It's getting out of hand. You need to do something about this. This is unbelievable. My own daughter threatening to take her own life? For what reason? Right. Match my daughter. What? Please. As you're going to school tomorrow, I don't want to get any kind of thing from anybody. You can run. Because I don't like the picture that flashed through my face just now. You know, you should leave it by me. You don't want to have friends. You don't want to have any friends. You want to talk of eating anything. Or taking anything from them. If you say so, please, I need to be very careful, okay? Meanwhile, this your rice is very nice today. Are you saying the ones I've been cooking are normal? I haven't said so.
Hi. How you doing? Fine. Uh, I'm Jenny by name. I'm Machi by name. Yes, it's a stress student. SS 1A. Oh. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Too. I've been noticing you're always alone. Don't you have friends? No, I don't make friends. So, can we be friends? Sure. I thought you were going this way. Oh, yes, I wanted to see you off. But there's no problem, we'll see you tomorrow. Okay, now take care. Going to? I'm going to the class. Oh, I'm just here to see my snacks. What's that you're eating? Oh, one of the new biscuits in town. Be careful. Yes, I've not seen such biscuit before. Ah, very delicious. Like you like it. Have a test. Sure. You like it? You can take more now. Have it. What are we doing here? Watch and see. Ah! Who are you? I know you are surprised and scared. I'm not Jenny. I'm the keeper of the sacred ancient tree of Okake. You are welcome to your responsibility. It has been years I've been on this mission to bring you to take up your spiritual inheritance. Please, I'm begging you. Don't kill me. I'm the only child of my mother. Fear not. You are above human destruction. What is it again? Can't you leave me alone? I've told you I'm not interested in serving any tree. Let me be. I've told you, you are not going to run away from your responsibility and destiny. What nonsense responsibility are you talking about? Who are you talking to? Um. Talking, I was not talking to anyone. Maybe I was talking to myself. Yourself? Since when did you start talking to yourself? Mm, what's all this? Machi, I hope it's not what I'm thinking. So tell me, should a mother allow something that happened to her during her young age to happen to her daughter also? The answer is capital no. See my dear, I've seen things. Oh, you are calling me. Yes, I called you, my dear. Watch my daughter. You have really changed. You talk to yourself every night. Your behavior generally has changed. You have been acting strange. My dear, is there anything you want to tell me? Please talk to me at your mother's time. Mama, I've told you countless times. You shouldn't worry about my recent behavior. I'm fine and I'm okay. Stop bothering yourself. Ashley. You lie. Machi, all is not well with you. I know you have a spiritual problem. I know. You know what? We are seeing Reverend again tomorrow morning. Huh? Yes. For what? 
Ki hace la panique en chingón. Ay, Where are you coming from? I, I went to Mukichi's house to ask for her uh, economics note. Which economics note? Much, I told you we are going to see Reverend Ken this morning. And you went to Kechi's house. See the time you're coming back. Well, I know there's something wrong with you spiritually. But whatever it is, we must see Reverend Ken tomorrow morning. Went to Kechi's house. I joined we must be delivered from whatever it is that is, that is wrong with you. Like this time. Oh, sorry. 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 You deceived me, why? Nobody no, no, no. deceived me. What you are seeing right now is what you bargained for. See, my dear, you possess the magic of the first order. And it is written in the sacred book that was made available to you. That promotion will take something you love and cherish so much. Why my mother? Why didn't you take someone else? Why? Now she's gone. What am I living for? You lack the ability to ask the secrets of her. Why? Now that you are promoted, go into the world and make it lie. Mother, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't know what I was doing. I know I'm foolish for not listening to you. You warned me. Why didn't you listen? Please forgive me. Forgive me, I was deceived. I was deceived. I'm deeply sorry. To my daughter. Oh, please. So, baby, it's good to know. 
I don't want to get any complicated for me. Because I don't like the picture that flashed through my face just now. You know, you should know by me. You know, I don't have friends. I don't have any friends. You want to talk me of eating anything or taking anything from them? If you say so, please, I need to be very careful, okay? Meanwhile, this your rice is very nice to me. I don't say the ones I've been cooking and all my things. I haven't said to you. I don't like the picture that flashed through my face just now. You know, you should know by me. You know, I don't have friends. I don't have any friends. You want to talk me of eating anything or taking anything from them? If you say so, please, I need to be very careful, okay? Meanwhile, this your rice is very nice to be. Are you saying the ones I've been cooking and all my days? I haven't said to you. What is that? Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Fine. Uh, I'm Jenny by name. I'm Machi by name. SS3 student. SS 1A. Oh. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. I've been noticing you're always alone. Don't you have friends? No, I don't make friends. Wow, that's nice. So, can we be friends? Sure. Okay. I thought you were going this way. Oh yes, I wanted to see you off, but there's no problem. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay, okay. now take care. Where are you going to? I'm going to the class. Oh, I'm just here to see my snacks. What's that you're eating? Oh, one of the new biscuits in town. Be careful. Yes, I've not seen such biscuits before. Ah, very delicious. Like you like it. Have a taste. Sure. You like it? Mm. Don't take more now. Have it. Oh, you are coming. Yes, I got you, my dear. You have really changed. You talk to yourself every night. Your behavior generally has changed. You have been acting strange. My dear, is there anything you want to tell me? Please talk to me at your mother's time. Mama, I've told you countless times. You shouldn't worry about my recent behavior. I'm fine and I'm okay. Stop bothering yourself. Ashi, you lie. Machi, all is not well with you. I know you have a spiritual problem. I know. You know what? We are seeing Reverend again tomorrow morning. Yeah? Yes. For what? You are still ready to get to
where are you coming from? I, I went to Mukichi's house to ask for her uh, economics note. Which economics note? Much, I told you we are going to see Reverend Ken this morning. And you went to Kechi's house. See the time you're coming back. Well, I know there's something wrong with you spiritually. But whatever it is, we must see Reverend Ken tomorrow morning. Went to Kechi's house. I joined you. We must be delivered from whatever it is that is, that is wrong with you. I was deceived. I don't know what I was doing. <laughs> Forgive me. <laughs> Okay, my dear. The reason God blesses us is for we to bless others. Just be a good girl. Promise me one thing that when you go back to school, you will stay away from bad company. Okay? I want you to make your late mother proud. Stay away from trouble. You don't need trouble. If you remain good, I know you're good. I will see you through your higher education. It's okay, my darling. Wipe away your tears, please. I'll do anything in my power to make sure your late mother is happy in the grave. Please. Hmm? My husband knows how she saw me throughout secondary school. Eh? It wasn't easy for her. <laughs> Had it been your dad did not die. At least I would have been in the university oh, yeah, by now. I would have been a graduate. Stand it's okay, stand it's stand okay, stand my darling. It's okay, Machi. You make me cry. You make me cry, Machi. It's okay. We are one family. Please, we are one family. Please. Greetings. The possessor and the controller of the magic of the first order. What do you want this time? I have told you and your evil tree that I'm no longer interested. You've killed my mother! What else do you want from me? How dare you insult your creator? The one that can destroy your body and your soul. Machi, you are playing with fire. If you are thinking of dumping your responsibility. What stupid responsibility are you talking about? Destroying children's future and depopulating the kingdom of light to increase the kingdom of darkness is what you call destiny and responsibility. I can see you want the rod of the sacred tree of a bakery. Remember, no man born of a human can contend with the rod of the sacred tree of a bakery. Thank your star that you are the choosy one. Yes, you would have been dead by now. Then what are you waiting for? Why not take my life? After all, you've killed my mother. There is nothing left in this world for me to live. Then just kill me. After all, you killed my mother. There is nothing for me to live.
I was hearing strange voices. Maybe I was sleep-talking. Sleep-talking? No, now you can't be sleep-talking. I was hearing strange voices. God forbid. What happened? Those voices that I had while sleeping were coming from her room. Whose voices? Umachi and the voices. But immediately Umachi came out from the room. I forgot everything I had. <laughs> Babe, you need to rest. Please, come and sleep. Tomorrow morning, I'll take you to the doctor. I think you have malaria. Baby, I am not joking. I mean everything I said. We'll see the doctor tomorrow morning. Just come and sleep, please. Baby, I'm not joking. You are not joking. Please, let's sleep. I'll take you to the doctor tomorrow. I don't know what you're talking about. Hold me now. <sighs> I've told you countless times to embrace your responsibility and reign in your world. You once told me that as the possessor of the magic of the first order, I have the proficiency and efficiency to say anything I want and it shall be granted. Yes, your sister's husband is a threat to your destiny. And if you don't put him to his place, he will destroy you and your destiny. No. My uncle is the only family I have right now. I can't kill him. Nobody is asking you to kill him, Mika. Be careful. Machi, the sacred ancient tree of Obakiri is no longer happy with you because you have refused to carry up your mission of depopulating the world. to bed. Maybe tomorrow you continue from where you stopped. Hmm? It's already late. Remember you're going to school tomorrow. Hmm? No, Mom. Mom, I have to finish up with this assignment. And tomorrow I have quiz in school. So, once I'm done with this, I'll go on to the rest. If you insist, you must finish it. No problem. Who am I? But it's already getting late. Let's go and sleep. I'll be inside. I was expecting you to join me in the room. Okay, Mom. Don't take too much time. Thank you, Mom. Akada. I love you, Mom. I love you more. Hey. Hi. Hi. Mm, well, I'm Masinachi. I'm Maria. Okay. Maria, I, I don't mind if you can be friends. If you can just be friends so you can help me go through some classwork, some mass assignment and a lot of things. Because I, I saw your performance in the mass class and how you answer all the questions. You're really brilliant and intelligent. Thanks for the compliments. But the truth is, I don't keep friends. I really don't. But I can teach you mathematics. That will not be a problem. Wow. Okay, so when should we start? You can start today, tomorrow, anytime. Um, uh, I'll prefer now. Let's start now. Let me go get my math textbook. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Hey. 
Hey. Hi. Hi. Mm, well, I'm Masinachi. I'm Maria. Okay. Maria, I, I don't mind if you can be friends. If you can just be friends so you can help me go through some classwork, some mass assignment and a lot of things. Because I I saw your performance in the mass class and how you answer all the questions. You're really brilliant and intelligent. Thanks for the compliments. But the truth is, I don't keep friends. I really don't. But I can teach you mathematics. That will not be a problem. Wow. Okay, so when should we start? You can start today, tomorrow, anytime. Um, uh I'll prefer now. Let's start now. Let me go get my math textbook. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Machi. Machi. What is it? Machi, talk to me. Why are you crying? So to go home. You ought to go home. To where? I want to go and meet my mom. I want to go to my father's house. Amachi, you and I know that your mother is no more. What would you want to go and do in the house? The house is lonely. Your mother, my late sister, is no more. So what do you want to do in the house? You know that the environment is so lonely. I have told you several times that if you need anything, you should let me know and I will provide it for you. So why do you want to go back home? It seems your husband don't want me here again. What? Yes, he does not like me. And I don't want to cause problems in your family or your marriage. Let me just go in peace. Imagine. Before it gets worse. You are not causing any problem in my marriage. What are you talking about? The fact is that my husband loves you so much and he wishes to have a daughter like you. So what are you talking about? Talk to me. What are you talking about, Machi? Don't go home. Please let me go home. Machi, you are not. My going husband home. does not love me. Okay, fine, he loves me. I, I accept he loves me, but let me go. I don't see you, good woman. I don't, I don't want any bad things to happen to you. Please, I don't want you to lose your marriage because of me or have problems in your marriage because of me. Please let me go. I am not going to lose my marriage because of you, Machi. The fact remains that my husband loves you so much. Please, Machi, come to me. I don't want you to start crying. Greetings, the possessor of the magic of the first order. You sent for me. You told me being the possessor of the magic of the first order. You said anything I want will be granted to me. But the first day I met the ancient tree, I've been asking him for one thing. And up to now, he hasn't granted my request. First, let me correct and pull the record straight. The ancient and secretary of Obaku, I've never and can't disappoint anyone that look up to you. In your case, I don't know what you have been asking of him. Hmm. I've been asking of him to make me the most intelligent girl in my school. I want to be so brilliant. I want to be the girl that everyone will look up to in class. But anytime I keep on telling him this, he'll be telling me it's done, it's done. But nothing's happening. How's it done? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? What's funny? Patient and secretary is angry with you. That you won't know because of what you possessed. Much. When you realize whom you have, all this you added on. Begin your assignment on earth. I repeat, all this shall be added to you. 
How come your wife does not hear the strange voices? Pastor, my wife believes I'm cooking up stories just to call her niece a witch and ask her to leave my house. Pastor, can you believe it? Each time that I raise up this matter just to find solution, my wife makes my house miserable for me. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Don't worry. Uh, Imeka. I shall invite your wife for counseling. Thank you very much, Pastor. I really appreciate it. Shall we pray? Greetings to yourself. Who was that girl I saw you with? What are you doing with her? Don't you dare lie to me. You know what? Stay away from my daughter and I. Did you hear me? Animal. Mom? You're not sleeping yet? No, Mom. Why? I'm waiting for you. Yeah, baby. Go ahead and sleep. I'll join you later. Mom, who are you shouting at on the phone? Why do you want to know? This a miserable business partner. You know, sometimes men. No, don't worry, I'll join you later, okay? Are you okay, Mom? I am very well. Can't you see I'm fine? Go ahead and sleep, okay? Okay. Mm. I'm coming. Alright. What is this? Look at the cows! I'm very tired and hungry. Uh -uh. How are you? How did you go? Mom, why didn't Uncle Chus come to pick me today? <sighs> Chus has gotten a better job. So in the interim, either you come back for yourself, I'll come and pick you anytime I have chance. Alright. Until I get a better driver. Thank you, Mom. But I miss him. Already? Mm -hmm. Can you invite him for dinner? Hmm, I don't understand. Maybe one of these days I will invite him. But for now, no plan in, in place for that. Okay, Mom. <sighs> Maria! Yes, Mom? Okay, the first one I called wasn't enough. I'm sorry, Mom. I was trying to... Trying to do what? You called. Yes, I called you. I saw a piece of cake in your bag. Who has it? 
Oh. Um, one of our students celebrated her birthday in class and my teacher shared the cake to all of us. And you collected? Hmm? What did I tell you about eating outside? That is an error. What did I tell you? Do you want to get initiated? Didn't I tell you not to collect anything from anyone? They share general cake and you collected. What is wrong with you? Mom, but I did not eat the cake. I brought it back. So what is it doing in your bag? If you want to eat cake, go and buy yourself a cake and eat as much as you want. Okay, Mom, I've heard you. But Mom, you promised you're going to celebrate my birthday in school. I used to going to do that. I, used to going to... I changed my mind. Mom, but you promised. I have changed my mind. I told you no cake outside this house. If you want to celebrate your birthday, it is either you celebrate it in this house or in the church. If it's in the school, count me out. Okay, now that you don't collect things from anybody, who will eat the cake with you? Huh? Go and tidy the room. Mom, it's not fair. I said go and tidy the room. It is fair for me. Mm. Rubbish. You're humble. You're kind. But I won't let you because you break my heart. You break me into bits. <laughs> you even lied. You said you got a job somewhere else. Maybe you're trying to avoid me. Trying to dodge me. <gasps> Sorry, uh, I didn't know. Is it long you've been here? Mom, I was worried now. I didn't see you as promised, so I went to your room to look for you. You were not there, so I decided to come here. Should I get my assignment for you to solve here? No, some other time I'll help you. Just help yourself. Mom, you promised. Mom, do you love chokes? Uncle chokes? What? What did you say? You know about love? Is that what I teach you in school? Love? I'll be in your school tomorrow. I'll come to see your principal to ask if that's what I teach you in school. Love! So you know love at this age, you know love. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. I don't know anything about love. What are you sorry about? I'm sorry, Mom. What did you ask that question? If I love chokes? Is that what has been going through your mind? I'm sorry. Undo your assignment. I want to be left alone. I'm not helping you again. I'm not helping you again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Come on, please. Yes, I called you. I saw a piece of cake in your bag. Who has it? Oh. Um, one of our students celebrated her birthday in class and my teacher shared the cake to all of us. And you collected? Hmm? What did I tell you about eating outside? That is an error. What did I tell you? Do you want to get initiated? Didn't I tell you not to collect anything from anyone? They share general cake and you collected. What is wrong with you? 
Mom, but I did not eat the cake. I brought it back. So what is he doing in your bag? If you want to eat cake, go and buy yourself a cake and eat as much as you want. Okay, Mom, I've heard you. But Mom, you promised you're going to celebrate my birthday in school. I used to going to do that. I, used to going to... I changed my mind. Mom, but you promised. I have changed my mind. I told you no cake outside this house. If you want to celebrate your birthday, it is either you celebrate it in this house or in the church. If it's in the school, count me out. Okay, now that you don't collect things from anybody, who will eat the cake with you? Huh? Go and tidy the room. Oh, well, it's not fair. I said go and tidy the room. It is fair for me. Mm. Rubbish. Why are you stopping my mission? I'm the same mission too. And there's nothing you or anybody can do about it. Who do you think I am Cassandra, messenger of the seven seas. I am here to take her to our queen mother. My leg is buried. And there's nothing our queen mother can do about it. Because Mother Earth has chosen me to be the possessor of the magic of the first order. So we share with you as the next month. Challenge the cat to a battle. And you has challenged it! to your school, you both had closed and nobody was there. At that point I went there, I didn't see anybody. How did you manage to come back? Who brought you home? Uncle Chooks. What? Which Uncle Chooks? The one you know. Well, what do you have me do? I mean, your number was not going through and everyone had already left me. I had no option. She's pregnant. That can't be possible. The keeper told me babies are my enemies. And if they are born, they will override my position. She can't give birth to that child. I won't let anyone take my position, not even my sister's child. My divine destiny cannot be destroyed. 
as the controller and the possessor of the magic of the First Order. I won't let anyone take my position over my dead body. No one will. I am here to warn you again, and hopefully for the last time, stay away from Maria forever! I've told you to leave Maria alone. She's mine. Leave her alone. Else, else what? Else what? What to you do you pop, Kukuchi? I will show you what Python does with it. Then prepare to dance the dance of the spirit. You just dug your own grave. Place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. No harm shall befall you. No evil eye shall see you. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. Lord of Jesus. Don't worry. I'm, I believe you didn't pray before you dozed off, right? Yes, Lord. Have you seen the, the, the results? I dozed off. And you didn't even have your bath. Why would you have nightmare? I was very tired. I've always told you, no matter how tired you are, pray. Say your prayers. God bless you. Come. It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry. So she's pregnant. That can't be possible. The keeper told me babies are my enemies. And if they are born, they will override my position. She can't give the judge. I won't let anyone take my position. Not even my auntie's child. My divine destiny cannot be destroyed. My divine destiny cannot be destroyed. As the controller, and the possessor of the magic of the First Order. I won't let anyone take my position over my dead body. No one will. Un chien très major, athée, athée. Un chien très major, athée, athée. Un chien très major, athée, athée. 
It's not by power. It's not by power. But by my spirit, says the Lord. This mountain has been removed in Jesus' name. This mountain has been removed in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, Amen. my Father, my Maker, the El Shaddai, the righteous God, the Lion of Tribe of Judah, the God that said yes, and no man can say no. When you open it, a door, no man can shut it. Father, we thank you for life. We thank you for health. We thank you for every good thing you've done in our lives. Father, may your name and your name alone be glorified. Amen. We confess our sins unto you, Jehovah. Amen. In every way we have come short of your glory. Lord, may you forgive us and cleanse us with the blood of Jesus. Lord we plead Jesus. mercy on our lives. Therefore, Lord Jehovah, we stand on your word. You Lord Jehovah, King of glory, he said, we will hold our peace. In the book of Exodus 14, say you will fight our battle. Jehovah, King of glory, Arise, O oh Lord my God. In the book of Psalm 68, he said, Arise, Jehovah, and let our enemies be scattered. Any man or woman planning or occultic initiation for my daughter, stop against them yes. and we trample their powers. Amen. We bring their powers down. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father, if it be for us, O oh Lord Jehovah, who can be against us? Arise, O oh Lord Jehovah, yes, Lord. and let our enemies be scattered. Amen. My accompanied boss from Toria, let the real mass enter here. Jehovah, King of glory. Fire. He said, I kept them by the word of our testimony and the blood of the Lamb, Jehovah King of Glory. We have won our enemies. Yes. We have defended them in battle. Yes, we have Lord. burned down their powers. We have trampled upon them. Yes, in the Lord. name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Amen by fire. Amen. Lord, have your way. Lord, will give you praise. Thank you, Lord. Lord, will give you praise. Thank you, Lord. Lord, will give you praise. Thank you, Lord. Lord, will worship you. I worship Lord, you. Lord, will magnify you. I magnify you. Thank you, you everlasting Thank you, Lord. Thank you for answered prayers. Yes, Thank you because you said, Oh Lord Jehovah, in your word, that if you ask, you will answer us. Mm -hmm. If you will knock, you will open the door for us. Mm -hmm. Thank you this day, Jehovah, Thank because you. you have released your spirit of protection yes. upon us, O Lord Jehovah. Amen. I shield you with fire. fire. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. No Jesus. arms of the enemy will touch you. Amen. No eyes of the evil one will touch you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, everlasting Redeemer. Thank for you me. have done it. Mm -hmm. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. 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 Maria, this is Maria is she the most intelligent girl in that school? How will that intelligence do? Are we not? Maria will be the one to present us in mathematics in the house sports competition. She's still the one that will present us in the international essay competition. What of us? Eh? I don't like this at all. I have told you countless times that that principal have a very, a very big hatred on us. Sometimes I wonder if the controller of the first magic order is behaving like one Shut up. The keeper. The keeper. What about the keeper? What is going on? Maria this Maria that. Why can't I be like her? Everyone is talking about her in school. Why can't it be me? I want to reign like her. Mathematics competition, Maria. Inter-school competition, Maria. What is going on? Now I'm believing that you deceive me. Machi, every achievement and success in life comes with sacrifice. Sacrifice? What other sacrifice are you demanding for? Eh? I have sacrificed my loyalty and happiness. I even sacrificed my beloved mother. So what other sacrifice do you want? You are correct, my controller. But you can't have two vital things at the same time. It's one after the other. Listen. I want to be in control of that school. I want to be in charge of every activity in that school. I want to be the head. I want to be the intelligent girl everyone will be looking up to, not Maria. You're already in control of that school. 
Do you know you carry divinity in humanity? Where are the others? Where is the doctor? The doctor is inside. Do you see The doctor is attending. To you. Hey! Please sit down. Oh, okay. Sit, sit down. Okay. Did you see the doctor yourself? Yes, yes, yes. Did you see my daughter yourself? Yes, she's uh -huh. she's she's okay. Uh -huh. Okay. What are you doing here? You feel like a distraction or confusion. I'm supposed to be asking you that. I've warned you to stay away from Maria. She belongs to us. No. Maria is mine. You lie. She's mine. She's going to join force with me. So we can rule this world together. And there's nothing you can do about it. She belongs to us. Madam, the doctor has a brain abscess. Brain abscess? What does that mean? I've never given her any injection of late, let alone on the head that will form the abscess. Where is that coming from? It's like a better to have never heard about any ailment like this. What does it mean? Brain abscess is a connection of pores that develops in the brain or an infection in the brain. A collection of pores that developed in the brain. That means that brains are decaying. <laughs> Doctor, please, I beg you, God's name. What is the cause of this infection and symptoms you just narrated now? Causes include infection in other parts of the body or an improper functioning immune system. Same to virus, depending on the location of the brain, but it may cause headache. Nausea increased due to the pressure of the brain. Three cases, neurological symptom. Oh, madam, don't worry, she'll be fine. Doctor, you spoke a lot of English, which I didn't make one single sense out of it. But all I want to beg you is that do everything you can. Help me. She's all I've got. I don't have any other child apart from her. When it won't be a problem. Please save my daughter. Please. Do all you can. And we'll be praying at the background to make sure that everything you're doing is working well. Don't worry, she'll be fine. Money won't be a problem. You can find. But what is this neurological whatever you said? That word is very long. Mm -hmm. That neurological is when it's related to the brain. Oh, when it's related to the brain? Yes. Does that mean her brains are decayed? Mm -hmm. Anyway, because she's in your care. Do your best. No problem. And we'll be praying for God to help us. No problem. She'll be fine. Hey! I know you. You agent of Cassandra. What are you doing? What have you done to her? I hope it's not what I'm thinking. And if it is what you're thinking, what will you do? You witch. It is stupidity that makes a bullet land on the head of a monkey. You should have stayed before attacking Maria. Today you have met your doom. Who are these girls? You have to do doctor. Doctor, yeah. Yeah. Um, we are Maria's friend. We heard what happened to her, so we came to check up on her. Yes, we oh. heard what happened yes. Oh, okay. She will be well soon. We can see her now. She needs rest. Okay, can we see her tomorrow? People can come back tomorrow. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't worry, madam. The medicine will tame her. Yes. Are you sure? I'm afraid to say this. Maria's health is 
getting out of hand. She's yeah. getting bad by the minute. Don't worry, she'll be fine. Just walk according to the drug description. She'll be fine. That's it. I'll do as you said. Thank you so much. I will not have you insult me here. Listen to me, Jenny, and listen to me. Will cut. When you are done ranting, make use of that door. Leave my sight this minute. I said out. Are you asking me to leave? Oh, yes. Leave. All right, okay. I will. But well, before I do, I want to tell you something. Do not lose a good woman for anything. I know you're seeing another woman. But well, remember, the devil you know is better than the angel you don't know. Take ah. notes. Have a good day. Um, excuse me. Please hold you. Sit down. Please, sit down. You know what I... I am very, 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 very and extremely and deeply sorry for raising my voice on you. Better. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me. Now you're talking. It's okay. Let me bless you, okay? Yeah. Let me go in, dress properly, then come up and bless you. That's cool. <laughs> it's okay. I'll be with you in the GP. <laughs> I trust you, Amy Milonia. Come back with your lessons. Are you okay? Why are you carrying knife? I am here to bless you. Are you still sitting down? Get out of my house Please. before I I'll come leave. in, Mandra! I get out! I'll leave. Get out! It has not gotten to this. Get out! I'll get out of my sight! Leave! Please. Just imagine this. Lunatic! Are you now my chief advisor? Fool. Understand your pain. I know what you're going through. Drove out and got an extra well just to make sure that you don't miss this appointment. This is money we're talking about. Sweet oh, yes. I'm almost done. Okay, so just relax. I need this money. I need it. Now tell me. How do I look? <laughs> Turn around. Turn around. Yeah, yeah. Give it to me, baby. Give it to me, baby. <laughs> You look good. Thank you. Mm. Oh, yes. So let's go. <laughs> oh. I know you'll be back in the chief. Uh, <laughs> you don't have a choice. <laughs> <laughs> Christopher. Good evening. Oh, good evening, madam. How, oh, how are you? I'm fine. This one, your hair. I hope Maria is fine. Yes, I came to pick her up. <laughs> pick her up? But Maria is not in school. She didn't come to school today. Even the class teacher came to ask after her health. And she said they'll come to your place to visit her over the weekend. I don't understand. 
What do you mean Maria didn't come to school today? Because I personally dropped her in front of that block of a classroom inside this, in the school premises. So what are you talking about? She, she didn't come to school. I didn't see her. Nobody saw her. What are you talking about? I personally brought my child to school. You're telling me she didn't come to school. That means you didn't see my child. Not at all. Principal, are you okay? Wait. Oh, madam. Can you open the classroom? Let me look for her. Nobody is there. It's only the security man. So I'm about leaving before you came in. Wait, wait. Can you tell me what happened? Madam, Maria is not in school. She didn't come at all. Good hey! Man. Maria comes to school today. No. She didn't come to school. Madam Principal, I cannot continue in this kind of frustration. What is this? Who is doing this to me? Maria! Better come out from whatever you are hiding. And stop punishing me. What did I ever do to her? Listen, I am tired. I'm going back. I am tired of all this nonsense. I am tired. Um, Madam, please, you don't have to give up on her. We're in this together. Look at me. I'm here doing all this for my Maria. I'm supposed to have gone home, freshen up and then prepare for tomorrow's school. But look at me, searching for my intelligent Maria. Please, madam. This case of Maria is spiritual. That's why you don't have to give up on her. Mm. Yes. Whether spiritual or physically, I am tired. <sighs> I am tired! Just calm down. Everything will be fine. Let me continue with the search. Madam Prince, if you want to continue, you continue. Me, I'm tired. I'm going home. Come on, So this little witch, there you've met your due. What do you want this time? You engender destruction, frustration, and confusion. What I want? Mm-hmm. 
I'll teach you what you want to do. Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> My beloved, why are you doing this to your mother? Have you seen that? I'll teach you what you want to do. I'm so confused. <laughs> Just, what wrong did I do to deserve this? Madam, calm down. God is in control. I know for sure she will come back to normal. Just when? What will that be? You know, look at that water, that water. What will that be? Just calm down, madam. She will. Look at my. Look at my child. Maria. 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 Mama. Mama. Madam. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How is she? She's just there. Madam. Yes. This is the pastor I told you about. Oh. Pastor, welcome. Yeah, yeah. Look at this the mother that is it. Help me. Yes, Pastor. I know. Do you believe so? I believe it, Pastor. Hi! Hey. You foul spirits. You this spirit. Get out of this body in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You spirit of madness. Get out of the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The Bible says that your body is the temple of God. The Bible says no weapon fashioned against your body shall prosper. Amen. So therefore I say with the authority as the anointed man of God, I say, Get out! I come to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I go to the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I go to the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Get out! Get out! In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Get out! I come to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I go to the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Get out! Amen. Get out! Oh, she's where? Oh, that's so hey! My Maria! I'm so I'm good. Yes, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. But I always believe in you. I you, Maria. Oh, thank you, Jesus. What happened? Oh, nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. So tell me, should a mother allow something that happened to her during her marriage to happen to her daughter also?
cannot last in her home. Pretenders do the worst. A wicked woman can never last in her home. She's a dangerous, dangerous woman. She's here to do her.